What's going on guys and welcome back to some more Super Mario RPG in the last part. Uh, we basically uh, We basically saved Mel's parents, got rid of Valentina, did Culex, all that stuff. In this part we're gonna do uh, basically uh, we're gonna go to the volcano because we were told that a star is there. So if we uh, talk to these guys. Up here, up ahead are hot the springs but only royalty is allowed. Hey, you're the real prince. Sorry about the misunderstanding for There's no way that giant bird could have been a prince, huh? No big deal. Anyway, do you think he'll us through here? Of course. Go ahead. Please enjoy yourselves. Be careful not to fall into the volcano. Though, yeah, we cannot let ourselves fall into the volcano. And, uh, you take this bath right here. It actually prince fully and also danger beyond this edge of the volcano. And if we go down... We're falling. So yeah, this is Barrel Volcano. Uh, this is the this is where the six and last star is. Uh, these are new enemies. Well, they're technically not new enemies. They're actually exactly like the. Uh, w they're just the exact enemies in the uh, what am I trying to say? Yeah, Moleville Mines. But uh, yeah, the Lazy Shell with Mario did 440 damage, but uh. Much like the ones in the Mobile Mines, though, they, they will drop the uh, Lucky Jewel. Oh, also new enemy. Uh, I'll get rid of the special enemy first, but uh, we get the Lucky Jewel. Nice. So uh, yeah, and uh, these they're like the uh, the armor nets are like the uh, I think they're exactly just the ones in uh, Land's End, believe it or not. So we're not really doing we're not really too much in the new enemy. All right, let's find Yoshi. Oh, that's right. And no level up. We're gonna get a level up eventually. We're gonna get a lot of level ups if we get lucky jewels, let's just say, but um Oh new enemy. Oh another new enemy. This is the chained Kong, like the uh Donkey Kongas and uh they like the Donkey Kongas and uh what am I trying to say? They like the Donkey Kongas and uh the uh it's only stronger, but um, that's how a lot of these enemies are. It's a Super Nintendo game from 96, so even though it's a remake of that, you gotta kinda cut it slack, but uh, either way, we gotta level up. Page is level 19, and let's get our HP up. Oh, another army. These are herb spikes. These are the strongest, basically, of those, uh, what am I trying to say, uh, this is the strongest of spiked enemies. Did we get another XP double? Double XP? Yes. This is really only in the remake because it's much easier, but you can get lots, I mean lots of XP in this area. More level up. Let's see, uh... Mal's level 18 and Mal and Star Rain. Again, magic, and uh, on top of that, Bowser's level 18 and she learns Magic Koopa Stomp and we're gonna go physical. Honestly, I think we're gonna swap from Peach to Bowser because I think we should maybe use Bowser since we're attacking a lot of enemies, but uh, I don't know. Anyway, so I think there's actually, wait, there's that's not what I was thinking of what it was, but uh, I think there's gonna be a Starman coming up eventually, but um, anyway, so now we got uh, that Pell taking our system. You, again, much like the Mobile Mods, we kind of want to get more level ups. Oh, we got a star, so we might get a level up. Come on, give us that level up. Give us that level up. I think only Gino is close to leveling up, though, but, um. No level up. Lame. How close was Gino leveling up? 7 XP. But either way, he's going to get that level up, but, um. Oh, I guess we can just kill this and get the level up out of Gino. Aw, <laughs> oh, no! Let's kill this and get the level up out of Gino proper. Anyways, so Gino is level 19, and again, we'll go physical. Got a new enemy. These are the Lava Bubbles. These are essentially a stronger variant of the uh, ones from earlier.
And okay, Mario's almost a level up. Right now we got that battle with system. We don't even need to cut this just one enemy, but Mario is close to a level up. Yeah, he's like a uh, 15 XP away from a level up. So yeah, because we can, because controlling the locking tool is easier in the remake. Let's just say we're gonna get lots and lots of level ups. That front coin. Hold on, I want to. Uh, yeah, it's a new enemy, but uh, I wonder how we're gonna approach. Uh, we're, we know how we're gonna approach it. Me talking stupid right there, but uh. Yeah, we have to, uh, this guy right here. These are the, uh, Stumpets. They actually uh, get angry and then cause, like, a, uh... Yeah, I just want to get that Lucky Jewel, but, um... They actually can kill, use a movie that's, like, instant kill. Get 488, so, yeah. Let's use that Lucky Jewel to our advantage. Now we're doubling coins, though. Though we need coins, also. And Mario's gonna level up. Mario's level 20, and again, physical. Yeah, we should be really good. We should be around average level. We should be around maybe average level for this part of the game, uh, so, um, which is really nice, but... um, I think the other characters should also be close to a level up, but... Uh, oh, new enemy. Anyway, so this is the new enemy. <laughs> And this is the uh, Stomp Islers. Um, believe it or not, if they take you out, uh, if you don't take these things out first, both their parts, they will do a move called Migraine, which is an instant killer. So uh, just be a little careful and... And no level up. So, um... And let's see if we get a level up of this. I cut out the fight because they didn't find it necessary to show. And there we go. We should get a level up out of this. All right, we got some level ups, and uh, Mal's level 19, and uh, Magic, and um, Bowser's level 19, physical. Peach is level 20 HP, and um, so yeah, um, we're doing really well. So, um, Mario, um, I say Geo's the closest to a level up, but um, I think I'm gonna swap out Bowser and put back in the princess because she's gonna be an HP tank going forward, but um, because I set her up to be an HP tank, but um. This guy. Hey there, Hugh. So this is for you for a minute I'm hearing things. I'm sitting in This place is regular right furniture. Come on, step inside. Thunder Mart. So I'm um, in the armor shop and. We'll buy the fire pants for Mallow and uh, the fire dress for Peach and uh, I don't think we need, we'll buy, uh, we'll keep the work pants for Bowser, but uh, we don't need the fire shirt, but um, that's all we really get. We can, unfortunately, again, cannot get any weapons here. So um, I guess we can try to see if we can sell some shit. I don't want to go to the end. Let's see what we can sell. Um, we don't need these for now, so... Um, so yeah, I guess we could just need to sell the Coca-Colas, but... Um, we're actually almost done with this area, believe it or not. We have uh, a couple bosses to go through, actually. Yeah, I think Peach and Gino are pretty good. What's our... our Alright. Yeah, this looks pretty good. Anyway, so this is the... Probably the main boss this area. This is... This is the Sar Dragon. Now, um, he's gonna actually, uh, I think he has a weakness to ice, but I could be wrong. I'm not 100% sure. Even Peach doing nearly 200 damage, but, um, 
Yeah, we're also gonna we're gonna Geno boost everyone. So we're gonna Geno boost Mario. So Mario should do nearly si over 600 damage, and um. So yeah, and Geno boost um. That's Geno boost Peach, and uh. Yeah, we're basically gonna Geno boost everyone. So one, it's one of the reasons I personally like using Geno on bosses. He's actually not defeated. He's now in what is called a... He's in a second phase. He's gonna rise out of the lava. He's actually gonna be more vulnerable this position. Well, I think Peach is doing... Yeah, she's doing over 300 damage and Gino, Gino was yourself. I think Mario will do like 800 damage, I think. Yeah, 840. Each will do over th nearly 400 damage. So yeah, he's much more vulnerable. Even Geno's doing over 300 and he's down. He didn't get any level ups, unfortunately, but, um. Oh, shit. Yeah. So, uh, once we get out of here. There's the star. And where'd it go? Where the hell did it go? Hey, who are you? We got the star. We're amazing. We're unbeatable. We're gorgeous. You'd better leave now, chumps. Anyway, so what we're gonna do now is follow these guys. Hey, Red, look down there. It's gotta be the ugliest mustache I've ever seen. Ew, gross. This guy's worse looking than that Claude Mario. That is Mario, you idiot. Listen, we gotta get the start of the Blade Melee. We'll deal with Mario later. So, yeah, we gotta chase these guys. This is technically the real boss of the uh, Barrel Volcano, and uh, they look an awful lot like the Power Rangers. Yeah, they take a little liberty with that, let's just say. Uh, and we follow them, and we can actually make it in time. But anyway, they're gonna get out of Barrel Volcano, and we get out if we can fucking land on the platform, the spring. Where's the blade? He'll be here. Are you sure? Relax, people. Mario's here. He's too late. Where's the blade? Shut up already. Finally! Anyway! These are the Axem Rangers. We fight for evil. We live for disorder. We like what we do. We struggle for chaos. We are. The Axem Rangers. The star piece gives people hope. It needs to be destroyed. Now, these Axem Rangers, the pink one is more vulnerable, but she can heal. So I'd recommend taking her first. And the green one's also most vulnerable. So the pink one's the healer. So I'd recommend taking her out first. Yo, Red, what? My makeup's running. Then change brands. Anyway, so what we're gonna do now is, uh. Yeah, the green one's the second one, so take him out second.
This is gonna be Meteor Blast, which we can't block, unfortunately, but um, yeah, Geno Boost Mario. We're gonna Geno Boost ourselves. An accent green should be taken out. Yeah, 758 damage. Yo, Red, what? I got a headache. You're totally out of shape. And Red's you just used a uh, Vigrup, which uh, basically is uh, makes him stronger. But um, uh, let's use therapy on yourself. And uh, let's uh, let's attack, let's use uh, let's attack Black. Except we missed. But uh, but now we need to take out the Yellow because he is weak to Super Jump. Well, I get two jumps, but uh, I take him out. But um. He's doing over 138 damage, but um, I don't think Geo's gonna do as much with the lazy shell armor, but um, 105 damage and uh, Axe on Black get taken out. Mario's doing over 600 damage. You're right, what? I broke my shades, serves you right. Now, only one more Axe on Ranger is taken out, so 174. Or 39, and uh, another one. 746 damage, and they're all taken out. Ugh, and now I'm angry. Time to finish this. Formation, ho, here we go. Now, they're gonna use an all new attack called Breaker Beam. If they can uh, actually show it. Force Beam Energize, maximum charge. Now, fire the Breaker. This is Breaker Beam, which is an attack we can't block. It does a lot of damage, let's say. It did, almost, did pretty much half of Peach's health. And they're taken out. This is impossible. We are invincible. Can this be happy in the Axum Rangers? Uah! No level up, unfortunately, but uh, the breaker is destroyed. Six star pieces finally collected. Where can the last star piece be? Anyway, so we have to go all the way back to Nimbus Land. But I'm actually gonna cut it off for this part of Super Mario RPG. So next time Super Mario RPG, we're gonna find out where the hell we're going next. See you guys then.